human organism. Our body. This incredible biological engine includes about 100 trillion cells, 206 bones, 320 pairs of muscles, and 5 critical organs. The central nervous system is one of the numerous systems that enable life, movement, cognitive function, development, repair, and reproduction. The human body is designed to stand erect, walk on two feet, and utilize arms to carry, lift, and grab with opposable thumbs. In this video, we will look at some of the body's various systems and explore intriguing facts and information about them. Brain. The brain's 180 billion neurons control the body. Over 100 trillion synapses connect neurons. Small electrical currents and chemical messengers move information across the brain at 268 miles per hour. Your brain can power an LED light bulb with 12 to 25 watts. A mature brain weighs 3 pounds and is roughly the size of your hands with your thumbs touching. Brain folds enhance its size. A baby's brain is smooth whereas an adult's brain is like a walnut with many wrinkles. Brain tissue requires 20% of the blood's oxygen and glucose and dies after 5 minutes without oxygen. The nervous system sends and receives voluntary and involuntary messages to and from the brain through the spinal cord, which branches into smaller nerves throughout the body. Voluntary signals include picking up a pen or mentioning pins and needles. Because the brain is over 70% water, the nervous system and brain need a diversified diet and amounts of vitamin B1, B9, zinc, calcium, magnesium, and vitamin C. Heart. The muscle-fibered heart pumps blood across the body to supply oxygen and nutrients to cells. A healthy adult heart beats 60 to 80 beats per minute, removing carbon dioxide and fighting infections. Children's heartbeats are 100 to 120 BPM. The heart has four chambers to pump blood. Oxygenated blood enters the right atrium, then the right ventricle, where it goes to the lungs. Once oxygenated, it enters the left atrium, then the left ventricle, and a big squeeze of the left ventricle pushes blood into various arteries. Blood vessels carry oxygenated and deoxygenated blood around the body. Blood arteries. The human body has 60,000 miles of blood arteries. Red blood cells carry oxygen around the body and are so small that 2.5 million can fit on the head of a pen. An average adult has about 5 quarts of blood, and the heart pumps 83 gallons an hour or 2,000 gallons a day. Blood takes about 60 seconds to leave the heart, circulate around the body, and return to the heart. Lungs. Humans have two lungs side by side, but the left lung is slightly smaller to make room for the heart, and each lung has three lobes. The lung capacity depends on a person's size, fitness, and altitude. The average adult man has a 1.5-gallon lung capacity and breathes 12 to 20 times per minute, consuming 1,000 gallons of air per day. The average person can hold their breath for two minutes. Swallowing protects the lungs with the epiglottis. Dust and pollen are expelled through coughing and sneezing. Asthma is a respiratory disorder when the airways constrict due to an irritant, making breathing difficult. A person may live with one lung, but their capacity to exercise is limited since the lungs are the only organs that exchange oxygen and carbon dioxide. Smoking and air pollution causes lung ailments including cancer and emphysema, pulmonology studies lungs. Digestive system. The digestive system breaks down food into glucose for energy, protein for cell repair, and vitamins. The digestive system begins in the mouth where teeth mash food, the tongue moves it around, and saliva lubricates there. Digestion upon swallowing food travels down the esophagus and into the stomach where acid kills bacteria and breaks down the food further. The liquid food then enters a small intestine where the acid is neutralized and enzymes break down fat, protein, and carbohydrates. A 5-foot colon ends in direction, where adjusted food matter and gas are passed via the anus as excrement and farts. Stomach. The stomach is a muscular sac with hydrochloric acid and a mucus lining. It can hold 0.5 gallons of food and liquid, and nerves in the stomach tell your brain when it's empty or full. The small intestine receives partially digested food called chyme from the stomach. The pancreas manages blood sugar in the small intestine, which is 16 to 20 feet long and roughly the thickness of your thumb. Peristalsis pushes food through the gut. Immune system. Antibodies help the immune system recall and fight illnesses. Vaccines work by stimulating the immune system to create antibodies for specific diseases like polio or measles without actually getting them, protecting the person from that disease.
It's important to get vaccines even if the disease is no longer common because of the herd immunity effect, which occurs when a large portion of the population or herd is vaccinated, protecting those who aren't. Stress, smoking, lack of sleep, poor food, and HIV AIDS can decrease the immune system, rendering you susceptible to infection. Allergies are false alarms caused by an overworked immune system. Allergic responses can induce anaphylactic shock and breathing difficulties. Immunology is the study of the immune system, which fights its own body in autoimmune illnesses like lupus. Without bacteria to create antibodies, the immune system can't learn what's hazardous and what's not. Reproductive system. The reproductive system reproduces to pass on genes. A woman's reproductive organs include a pair of ovaries that form eggs and the uterus where our baby grows until it's ready to be born. A man's reproductive system includes the testes where sperm is formed and a penis for delivering sperm into the uterus. When an egg and sperm cell fuse during sexual activity, conception occurs and the baby begins to grow. A human baby's gestation period is 40 weeks or 9 months. Skeleton. Humans are vertebrates, meaning they have a backbone or spinal column. An adult skeleton has 206 bones, while a baby has 300 bones, some of which fuse as they grow. The largest and strongest bone in the body is the femur, and the smallest bones are in the middle ear. Cartilage cushions the bones, and tough ligaments hold them together. Hard bone provides structure, porous bone includes air spaces, and bone marrow produces blood and stem cells. A healthy human bone can withstand three times your body weight in force arm and leg fractures. Breaks are more common in growing children because the growth plates there are vulnerable. When bone fractures or breaks, special bone cells will surround the injury. Bone is mostly calcium for strength and collapsibility. An X-ray may show a person's bones. Adults attain their full height and bone density in their 20s and 30s. Osteology studies burns, osteoporosis, and arthritis. The body's 320 pairs of skeletal muscles allow it to move in hundreds of ways. Muscle proteins produce strands of muscle fiber, which form bundles to form the biggest skeletal muscles. When your bicep contracts to elevate your forearm, your tricep relaxes. Skeletal muscles work in pairs. Muscles move bones, ligaments link bones, and tendons connect muscles to burn. Your muscles contract or relax based on nerve impulses from the brain. Muscles are produced and mended when microscopic breaks in the muscle fiber are filled in with new muscle cells. They need oxygen, glucose, and protein to operate and regenerate. Myology studies muscles. Please like these fascinating human body facts. Subscribe and hit the bell to receive weekly video updates.